Well, you had a full day. Welcome to Davey Dave's Take. Today we are talking about Drive Away Dolls, a new film written and directed by Ethan Cohen. In search of a fresh start, two friends embark on an unexpected road trip to Tallahassee. Things quickly go awry when they cross paths with a group of inept criminals. I was excited for this film because of Ethan Cohen. I mean, him and his brother Joel directed No Country for Old Men, Fargo, some of the greatest films of all time. But I was excited to see a solo film from him, and I thought the trailer looked pretty fun, and that's what Drive Away Dolls is. It's a pretty fun time. The first thing I gotta say about this film is that it's paced extremely well. This film is under 90 minutes long. And it definitely feels that runtime. It feels like a quick fun adventure and for this film that works so well. Like towards the beginning there are aspects that I could see in other films be dragged out a little bit with certain character development but here it wastes no time. It shows certain things visually and it kind of gets to the point and I really appreciate the film for doing that. It really does feel like this film just wants to show you a quick fun journey and doesn't want to waste your time at all. And the reason why the film feels fun and it's paced pretty well is because of the comedy. It really works here. There's great comedic timing with some of the sequences, the performance it all really works and yes all the performances here are great I thought everyone did a great job everyone was really funny and I just thought everyone had good chemistry even the side characters everyone just worked together really well the comedy in the overall film has this unique style to it that really works for the film but it's not just the comedy that works in this film I thought the overall story with the characters their relationships and development with that was really well done you really feel some character growth throughout the film and what I find impressive about it is it feels like the film isn't wasting your time at all it all feels organic but it also feels like it's getting to the point. But I do have some issues with the film. First being some of the choices from Ethan Cohen always didn't work. Some of the style could get a little distracting and some of the comedy doesn't land. And that can definitely be an issue, especially if the film is this short and it's mostly comedy. So sometimes those scenes that don't really land can become a little distracting. But I gotta say, there's one joke in here that I thought was so fucking funny. It's one of the best jokes of the year so far. So maybe it makes up for that. But overall, Driveway Dolls, I thought it was a pretty solid time. It's a quick, fun, adventure with these quirky characters that are really funny with some great performances and a unique style to this film not everything just lands for me when it comes to comedy and some of the directing but overall it's still a pretty fun time i'm gonna give drive away dolls seven davy daves I think you should definitely go see this in theaters if you're interested. It's a quick watch. It's fun. But if you're not really interested, you could definitely wait till streaming for this to come out. But overall, like I said, it's still a fun time. So, Drive Away Dolls. Let me know what you guys love it once you've seen it. I'm curious to hear. And thank you, thank you, thank you so much for watching. Click here to see more of Dave Dave's Takes.